This problem reads, the cost of the bookshelf, including a 7.5% sales tax, was $133.68. Find the price of the bookshelf before tax. Round answer to the nearest cent if necessary. All right, so I'm looking at this problem, and it's asked me to find the price of the bookshelf before tax. So that's what I'm looking for. So I'm going to define my variable, and I'm going to let x equal the price before tax. All right, so the price before tax. I know if I have an item, I have its price, plus I have the tax and that all adds up to the total cost. Okay. In this case, my price is x. The tax is always going to be applied to your price, so it's applied to x. I know in this case it's 7.5%. When I'm using a percent in an equation, I change it to its decimal form, which means I move the decimal point two places to the left. So that makes 0.075. And tax is always applied to something, or percent is always applied to another number. The tax is applied to the price, so it's 0 0.075 times x. And that's going to equal my total cost, and the total cost including tax was $133.68. At this point, I have an equation in one variable that I can solve. I have x plus 0.075x, and I can always put a 1 here to remind myself that's 1x. 1 plus 0.075 is 1.075x equals 133.68. Then I'm going to divide both sides by the 1.075 so I can isolate x. So I just have a little calculator here with me that I will do that on, and I'm going to put in 133.68 divided by 1.075. When I do that, let's see if you can see what I got here, I get 124.35348. I'm asked to round to the nearest cent, so that would be 124.35, because the next digit is a 3 and it doesn't make it round up, so I would just say $124.35. So for my answer, which was what is the price before of the bookshelf before tax? The price of the bookshelf before tax. is $124.35, and my units would be dollars on that. If I wanted to check that answer, I could always take this bookshelf, and I could take that price, and I could find out the tax on that, add them together, and make sure I got the $133.68.